my friends, welcome back to the CJ Nerf channel, finally! Yes, guys, the whole CJ Nerf family has finally made it back to our house. And good news, it's still upright, yes. For those of you who have been subscribing to me over the last couple of weeks and wondering where the videos are, I had to actually mandatory evacuate my area due to Hurricane Florence. I was putting out messages in the community tab to keep in touch with all of you guys to let you know that the channel was going to be down for a while as we had to get out of the path of the storm. Um, three days ago, we actually managed to finally get back. My area, community, and counties are still under state of emergency. There are roads washed out, sinkholes, thousands and thousands of trees down. And... Uh, but we managed to make it back. So my friends, I'm gonna take you on a quick tour of the out part of my house and show you guys a little bit of the damage that was incurred around my property. I gotta say, knock on wood, I gotta find some after this. I didn't really sustain a whole ton of damage. I have a little bit of damage around the house and some water leaking inside, but nothing that was catastrophic where I was gonna lose everything. Uh, of course, the rival wall made it. That's a big plus, right guys? And, um, but unfortunately, a lot of the people in my community didn't make out pretty much as fortunate as my family did, and that's really sad to see. Um, there are tons of workers and aid workers and FEMA and everything else is down here. And I gotta say, they're doing a pretty good job of cleaning everything up and getting roads cleared out quick, because we have sinkholes, washouts, everything. It's pretty crazy. So I'm gonna give you a quick tour around the house. There is one person I wanted to give a quick shout out to, KD Wolf 27 Dude, you won my contest for the, what was it, the excess. Dude, I didn't forget about you, man. It's just that with the storm coming, I had to get out of town. So I'm going to get your contest winnings dropped off to the post office. I have not forgotten about you, my friend, and it will be coming. So if you've uh, been wondering what's going on, that's pretty much what's been going on. As far as the video schedule, I'm still going to be out for a little while, guys. I got a ton of cleanup to still do, but once I get it all back to normal, as you can see, I don't have very much to do inside. We're going to get the videos rolling again for you here shortly. So... Let's get outside and show you guys kind of what happened around where I miss my YouTube channel so much. We actually got back to our house about three days ago. We've done a lot of yard cleanup. I've been nonstop basically raking leaves, pulling down branches, trying to fix my yard and get it back up in my house to get it back to where it usually was. But I wanted to show you guys some of the minimal damage that I did sustain. Uh, here you see some trees are still down. I actually have people coming to fix all this today and uh, hopefully we'll get all this cleaned up um, but this is why my channel has actually been on hold for a while most of you know if you've been following me for any amount of time we had to evacuate because of hurricane florence my area is still under a state of emergency and it took a long time to get back we had roads washed out everywhere so even though my house is okay or at least it seems to be okay i have a couple slight leaks inside and you know a lot of tree damage and stuff like that I mean, as you can see, take a look at the pond. That big tree's over. Tons of trees are coming over from this little nature preserve next to me. Um, you know, one of my neighbors there had to cut down a massive tree. Here's another interesting one. This huge pine tree that's shadowing my house. This actually used to be perfectly straight. And as you can see now, it's pretty much leaning way over. And I'm calling uh, the local board to get that remedy. And you can actually see some more big trees down. I gotta say, Florence actually did quite a bit of damage. There are other parts of our state that actually got it worse than we did. Um, and we just got lucky. That's just really the bottom line. All you are interested on how we made out, if you can see right up there by the attic window, there's a little hole in my siding that we're gonna have to get repaired. Um, I did have a little bit of leaking inside my house in you know some random areas. But for the most part, all of the storm shutters that I put up uh, protected my house really really well I didn't have any kind of window breaks and for the most part you know we did pretty good it was more or less a really big problem of getting back here and for the first time in my life actually driving back into where I live in the area it was kind of eerie because you know you had FEMA set up you had all sorts of uh, agencies set up we got people here from all different states helping out with tree removals and you know helping people clean up their yards now keep in mind i haven't even gotten to my backyard yet and as you can see i got branches down all over the place um put the grill away and for the most part you can see back there there's just tons of branches coming over trees literally split in half um grills in the garage i actually have to get that back out here but my son's swing set survived <laughs> hooray 
some so some good news i guess guys so my friends i want to thank you guys for tuning into this video being patient with me as my me and my family got to get out to protect ourselves and now we're back cleaning up for those of you who are new and have yet to see one of my newer videos i look forward to talking with you guys in the comment section i'm glad you guys are staying around hopefully my schedule of videos will be back up soon and um i do appreciate you uh supporting me while i've been away so thanks a lot, everybody. More to come soon, hopefully, and I'll keep in touch. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys on the next video. Hopefully soon.